Okay, so last video, we um, took our squares and we arranged them and then I sewed them together. So that's what it should look like when you have it all sewed together. And you'll want to make sure um, that you press all your seams down so it's nice and flat. And you wanna double check that you match up in, in the corners the best you can. I mean, that's not perfect, but pretty darn close. Okay. So once you have that done, now we're gonna do, you need your two short sides and your two long sides. So your short sides, you're gonna take and you're gonna lay them like this. And I don't know, the instructions said that that should line up. Uh, this is the second one I've made and they've never lined up. So <laughs> what I would suggest is if you're off a little bit, just make it equally off on both sides. So this way and this way. And then you're gonna pin this, and you're gonna use that same seam allowance of um, a quarter inch. So pin the short sides first, which the short sides go on the top and the bottom. And then you'll sew a quarter inch. You're, show, you're gonna sew a quarter inch seam here, a quarter inch seam here. After you do that, it'll open up, open up, press out your seams. Then you're gonna take your long sides. And if I can kind of show you how this would look, you're gonna do it like this. Remember, it's always right sides together. So then I'm gonna sew this to here once that's done. So pin and then quarter inch. When that's sewed, open it up, right sides together. It's kind of hard to do it when it's not sewed yet, but I think you guys get the idea. And then a quarter inch here. So then when it's all done, um, you're going to look like you've got a frame kind of around it. Okay.